Hello gamers, uh, Pat here. Welcome to a review for a software I've been uh, using called EM Client, which is basically an email client. I've been using Thunderbird for a lot of years and recently I, I, I've been kind of getting tired of it. I mean, no improvements overall. And I did some research, uh, hey, why the hell isn't Thunderbird getting anything interesting and new? I didn't know exactly what, but I wanted something new. And it turns out that Mozilla kind of stopped developing uh, Thunderbird and said like, hey, Screw that. I want some a program that is actually improving stuff. So I go, I went on the internet and I searched for a different email client and I found this EM client. So I decided to, you know, review it, which is something, but by the way, a, a short suggestion, if you are using a software for a long time and you're kind of getting used to it, always try to look for an alternative because you might find an alternative that's somehow better, but, but you got stuck you know, using another software. Anyway, I, I've been doing that regularly on my channel, uh, reviewing software and so on, even that my channel is basically focused on games. Anyway, uh, what is EM, EM, EM client? <laughs> it is going to bug me a bit. EM client is basically an email client which uh, has all the normal functionality. So I'm not going to go into details about everything, but I, I'm going to tell you what I like exactly. Well, first of all, the, the program minimizes to tray. And I know that this might seem something stupid. Hey, you can do that with Thunderbird. Yeah, Thunderbird needed an extension, which actually kind of didn't work all the time. So <laughs> for me, this is something new and pretty great. Another thing that I love about this is basically the agenda. It basically integrates with your Google agenda. If your email is at Gmail, it, it, it will know how to pick up your, uh, your calendar if you want it and it's going to show up uh, here, which is actually great because it's, I'm kind of using the calendar uh, right now more often because it's integrated into a software I'm currently using. Yeah, yeah I, know, I know that you can go to Google slash calendar, whatever, but you know, I have to type that. I have to uh, wait for the thing to load. Well, over here, I can just press my button, which will launch my email client or double click on it. And I'm checking my emails and then, hey, I'm also seeing my agenda here, which is uh, nice overall. Also, the program can integrate itself with all those uh, big uh, chat supports. Uh, you know, chat, chat support, chat, yeah, chat supports in a way. It can integrate itself with the Google chat, right? So I had some, I, I had some guys on my Google account. So whenever I wanted to chat with them, I had to go to gmail.com and I saw in the left side, uh, Hey, this is, this is, this, those are my, my friends. I have to double click it. The pop window pop up, <laughs> window pops up and I type to them. Well, I can do that with, uh, with the chat right over here. You can see, uh, you see there it says chat. I can click it. It's going to go up and uh, so on again. Also, it's integrating itself with your contacts where I'm not going to click it because you are going to see all my, uh, you know, phone numbers and so on. Again, it's pulling it from uh, Gmail and you can also create uh, tasks and calendars. Basically, as you can see, uh, I have my Netflix payment. I have my Audible payment and I'm putting them there so I know exactly when to, you know, when they are when they are coming so i know to prepare myself for them to put money on the card and so on now the integration with uh, as i said i was using thunderbird i decided to use em client and you have to say uh, the movement has been pretty easily i mean really i just installed the software i Launch EM client and it detected that I had Thunderbird and just by clicking next, 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 and I had all my uh, accounts from Thunderbird easy to use on EM client. Uh, and I didn't even have to generate new passwords uh, because it kind of took them from Thunderbird. And when, when I say new passwords, I'm using, you know, two-way authentication and so on. And you should use it too, by the way, just because it's safer. And um, when you use a program, you need to generate a new password for that program. So I didn't have to do that. I did, however, you know, uh, EM client like Thunderbird and like other software, they are creating a profile folder in your C drive. And I kind of don't want to keep those settings on the C drive and I moved them to the D drive. So I kind of had to manually add all my accounts yet again, because when I moved the files over, I kind of didn't detect them. So it, this was in a way a good exercise for me to actually uh, see how the process of adding new accounts to it 
goes and it was really easy i really had no problems at all uh, i set up uh, you know gmail it automatically put in emac uh, em emap um, at gmail and so on at all the ports everything I did have to generate new passwords because it again, I don't know the old passwords, but it wasn't really a problem anyway. So the overall software, it's uh, really, really great. Uh, it has all the normal features of an email client. If you have any questions like, hey, does it has that? You write in the comments below and I will tell you that. Basically, this is what I love about uh, this, em this email client. Uh, it was easy to integrate. I've done it once and i don't have to do it again uh, it has an agenda from google it has um, the chat from google and it also integrates with facebook in case you want uh, that uh, i can see my contacts i can see my task i can see again the calendar which is the agenda basically and it minimizes to tray so i can just launch it it launches pretty fast i can put it into tray and whenever i receive an email it makes a sound i can uh, put it if i want to see a notification or not i can click it and i can easily write emails i can it even has teams i believe i kind of forgot about that anyway they, there are a lot of uh, settings you can do when it comes to appearance look teams i can change it to arctic i can change it to bordeaux <laughs> look pink oh my god <laughs> i can change it to systems so anyway it's I, I, I love to have this you know things that i can improve the program you know customize it and uh, so on so anyway give email um, a client a try it's basically free for personal use as long as you don't need more than two accounts and if you want to have more than two accounts added you need to buy a commercial version which basically costs something like $30 or $40, <laughs> I should have looked on the website before, but anyway, uh, there is a link in the description where you can uh, download the software, so anyway, uh, tell me your suggestion and your, um, your suggestions and your other software, I if you know another email client that you want me to try out, tell me, I'm open, I'm using email client right now, but I'm always open for other suggestions, so don't forget to write in the comments below, so thank you guys for watching this, I hope this was uh, useful to you, if so, give me a like, give me a subscribe, if no, give me a dislike, but tell me why, please, so I can improve my videos, so thank you guys for watching, uh, see you soon, goodbye.